everyone, welcome back to my channel. It's Lisa here on Lady Code, and I am so excited because today I'm talking about my favorite thing, which is hair extensions. Um, my second favorite thing, I love wigs and then hair extensions, but now that my hair transformation is complete, I do love hair extensions and I've been experimenting with different ones. So the one that I have in my hair right now is the Secrets hair extensions. Um, it's very similar to the Hidden Crown, except it's a lot more affordable. And this is their double volume, and you can see that there is, um, a little band right here but for my transition into blonde this was the best one because it really didn't damage my hair it didn't put any tension on my hair and I could wear it without like worrying about you know damaging whatever because my hair is pretty damaged from going from box dye black to almost platinum blonde this is a golden honey colored secrets hair extension from their double volume line so now that you have a good look at what it looks like with it on I'm gonna go ahead and take it off so you can see how easy it is to put on and off first of all and what it looks like without the extensions like okay I need that back in my hair ASAP so to put this in all I do is kind of like make a circle around my head with my fingers and then I'll just go ahead and clip my hair back like that and then throw on this hair clip kind of like a hairband and you can see like where it goes. It just has no tension on your hair whatsoever, which is the best part. And then I'll just take the clip out and just to like sort out any unevenness if I need to, I'll run over it with a hairbrush. So there's like bumps right here. Just smooth that out with a hairbrush. And that's it. It's so easy and it blends really well. I mean, I think it's like $20 or something. It's like in that range. I'll find the exact price and let you know and I'll link it down below as well for you guys But it just makes all the difference. It's so easy to use when I was in Vegas for my birthday uh, This is what I was wearing in my hair for all the pool parties and going out because it was just the easiest way to do it So for fine hair or for damaged hair, this is like my number one option. I'll link it down below It's very affordable and this is their double volume range Which I really like and it's enough to make a difference, but if you want like Va va boom like real noticeable difference and you still want to use the halo type then there is one I think it's called hidden crown and that will give you like a full set of extensions type of um, volume so it's very intense I've seen it and it's it's beautiful and it blends really well as well and it still doesn't damage your hair so moving right along the rest of these are gonna be clip-ins and my number one favorite clip-in extensions is the hair secrets and they are out of stock for my color, which really sucks, but these are the most beautiful hair extensions, the highest quality, and oh my gosh, this is the color that my hair used to be. How crazy is that? But um, I love these, like 100%. They're pricey, but I'm telling you, these are as good as it gets for clip-in hair extensions. They're dense, they're just luxurious, they're shiny, they can curl well, but they can also straighten well, and I just... I've never seen anything like and they don't ever get tangled or matty like the Bellamy ones so if you can afford it get these they're amazing these this is the Shanghai night color I think and it comes with one two three four five six seven pieces so I'll just go ahead and show you this is the four piece it's very dense you can see that um, and then it comes with two of the three piece ones so these are the two three pieces, and then it comes with two of the two clip ones. So here are the two two clip ones, and then what's left is the two one clip ones. So I find that this is like the perfect amount and the perfect density for Hair Secrets. Um, I used to be sponsored by them, but I'm not anymore, but I still highly recommend that you get these if, you're, if they have it in stock in your color and if you have the money. So best investment ever. Alright, so my second ranking for hair extensions is the Zala hair extensions. Um, I read a lot of good reviews online. I still definitely think that the Hair Secrets is way better, but the second choice would be the Zalas. And I got these because Hair Secrets was out of stock and these were like the second highest rated um, based on all of my research. So I got, I think like the nine piece. Hold on, one, two, three, four, five six seven eight i got the nine piece and then i lost the piece i was in miami going crazy i'm sure i lost it like at live nightclub or something i'm just gonna brush these oh maybe there it is just kidding i found it all right so let's count again so this is one two three four 
five, six, seven, eight, nine. So this is the nine piece set. I mean, when I want glam, like I want glam. Like when I'm putting in extensions, I want extensions. So I got the nine piece set. Um, I'm sure if you're not like as drama crazy as me, you can just get the five piece set. I do love that these extensions are very affordable. The prices on the website are in Australian dollars, so in US dollars it's even less, so I love shopping on Australian stores because it's like, oh, you thought it was 200 but it's actually like 180 and it's fun. Um, but yeah, so here are the Zalas. I'm going to actually put them in so you can see what they look like in my hair and I'll be right back. Alright, so I just put in the Zala hair extensions, you can see there's a ton of volume, like it's crazy. Um, but it's just like not dense, like I still feel like it's a little fat, not fat, <laughs> flat and just like heavy looking and almost like the Bellamy's, which kind of sucks because I really wanted to like these, but as far as like what's available and on the market and affordable right now, I think that they're pretty good. So um, I'm trying to step back so you can see like the full length of these. So this is like the full length of the extensions, like they're really, really long. So I ordered the 20 inch extensions and this is how long they are. So they definitely give you length and they do give you a nice density, but it's just not bouncy. Like I just don't know, there's just something missing and I just feel like they look heavy, but um, I haven't gotten them blended yet, so maybe once I like razor them and get the edges blended in a little bit, it'll work for me. Um, but it's just not... It's just not working for me, so I really hope that Hair Secrets restocks on my shade with the um, clip-in extensions too, because I really, really love that one. So these are the Zala extensions. I'm gonna leave them in because why not? Um, and the last one is the Bellamy Lily hair. Oh my god! So do you just see how stringy and like dull and matted the Bellamy looks? Like I'm trying to pull these pieces apart, and you can just see. It's almost like they mix the hair to make like a synthetic blend because this is just not working for me. And the edges are just like choppy looking and it's just um, whatever. These are the Lily hairs and I love Lily Galici, but these extensions are just not doing it for me. Their customer service is also really, really bad. So I definitely recommend that you stay away from Bellamy because I've had nothing but bad experiences with them. Um, it's almost like they're just like stuck up and really clicky and if you're not like a part of their little group or if you don't like worship the brand then they don't like you. So just stay away. Um, so yeah, so in order once again, my favorite, favorite, favorite is the Hair Secrets. Next would be the Halo just because it's so easy to use. So any type of Halo extension is awesome. Um, and then the Zala extensions, which is what I have in right now, and they're pretty good. Their shipping was really fast. It shipped from Australia, but it got here in like three days, so that was awesome. Um, and then just avoid at all costs the Bellamy. Um, I hope that this helps you with your search of hair extensions. Um, again, if you're getting the Zalas, I don't think that you need the nine piece set because I have everything in right now and I still have some pieces that I didn't put in my hair. So if you all want to see a tutorial with hair extensions, um, let me know what kind of tutorial you want, like a ponytail or like a, I don't know, how to make your hair look fuller with extensions or just a general video on how to put in extensions. Um, go ahead and leave those suggestions down below. I'm always looking for new ideas on how to create content. Um, but that's it. So thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you guys in my next video.